than 20 something for like a tub. Have you seen stretch marks that are like really out there? It's like, whoo. Hey guys and welcome back to my channel. As you can see down below, you can see what this is all about. I haven't done a haul in a really long time. I certainly hope I haven't. And this is a very different haul, okay? This is not about makeup. I really am trying to just cut down on my makeup buying. It's not a real thing, hey? I've been, I've been thinking about it and I'm like, mm -mm, I do not need to buy more makeup. And because of that, I didn't buy more makeup. But I thought you guys would like to know what I buy when I go into Discam. And normally when I go into Discam, because Discam prices are nice, Normally when I go into this game, <laughs> normally when I go into this game, I make sure that I buy my body care stuff. But this time around, it's a little bit different because all the things that I bought are things that I typically don't use. So I'm pretty much going to be trying all of these things out for the first time and I will be reviewing them because I'm going to be doing beauty reviews as well. So if I don't do the reviews on my channel, I'm definitely going to do it on my blog. So if you would like to see this video, this is the Discam haul body care, then definitely please do keep watching. Oh yes, and another thing before I start, this look, this really golden glowy wet look I've actually recorded, it's a Colourpop look, and I hope you guys enjoy the video. I'm not sure if it's going to be up yet by, by this time, or if it's not gonna be up yet, but either way, it is coming, so I hope you guys enjoy that video. So the first thing I got were these, which come in really, really handy if you're somebody who wears makeup very handy these are the softy oval cotton pads and that's pretty much what they look like i really really like these because they are bigger than your normal rounded cotton pads they are oval of course but they are much bigger so you cover a lot of surface area with more surface area with one of these than you do with the small ones so i decided to pick these up this is the first time that i've actually um bought these ones so I'm, I definitely do hope that they work out well. I don't know if you've used this before, let me know down below. The next thing that I picked up is the Nivea Cherry Blossom and Jojoba Oil Oil in Cream and this is for normal to dry skin. The reason why I picked normal to dry skin is because we are going into winter and my skin gets real dry in winter. But also, this is part of their new range because these were actually on special and I got two of them. There were uh, two of these for 70 bucks. That's pretty much what this one looks like, as you can see. Really want to try these out purely because of the scent. That, that I love cherry blossom scents. In fact, I recently bought a uh, body shop perfume like these everyday perfumes that i like to wear in cherry blossom as well so i really love cherry blossom scents and this is going to be one of my first time trying this so yeah excited about that and then i also got another oil in lotion but this time i got vanilla and almond oil now for me i love vanilla Oh yes, I love vanilla and anything that smells like vanilla is a winner in my books. So I decided to pick this up as well, normal to dry skin. So I definitely can't wait to try this out. I really, like from a long time ago, I've really loved Nivea products. I think Nivea products are great. Yes, they tend to be, as compared to the other brands, tend to be a little bit more on the pricier side, but they really work well. Like if it tells you it's for dry skin, Best belief is going to work on your dry skin, especially that that Nivea cream. Oh my god, it's amazing! And another firsty is this one. I have been using the Palmer's. It's like it's sort of like in a small tub. It's also a body lotion cream kind of thing. But I wanted to pick this one up because I saw it on Fleur de Force's channel, and if you guys know from a video past video where I was talking about a nail polish, I, I talked about Fleur de Force. She mentioned this. You guys, like, let me give you a good tip. Things that are made for pregnant women and stretch marks, those are wonderful. Doesn't necessarily mean that you can't use it. The reason why I say that is because over the past few years, I've been using um, Happy Event. Happy Event. It's an antenatal cream and it's for stretch marks and it has worked wonders on my stretch marks. Now let's not even lie, you know stretch marks are a real thing. I just really wanted to try this one out because I saw it on Fleur's channel. This is the Palmer's Cocoa Butter uh, Formula Massage Lotion for stretch marks and this um, has argan oil, almond oil, shea butter, collagen and elastin. So yeah, helps reduce the appearance of stretch marks. 
there you go as you can see so definitely want to try this one out we'll definitely let you know in a beauty review how it goes but i'm always keen to try new things especially when it comes to stretch marks and things like that i mean anything to reduce the stretch marks sometimes they really don't even really go away period but have you seen stretch marks that are like really out there it's like whoo so if i can reduce them by any means necessary then i will definitely try it so this i'm very very keen on trying definitely gonna try that one out and then the last four products i got are all from dove now dove has been doing the most like i follow dove and on social media and things like that and i wanted to see like i i'm just really excited by the new packaging the new products the formula and i grew up on dove soap for my face and uh for my body what's my hair doing i grew up on dove soap soap for my face and for my body so when these came out i was so excited and the first thing that i have tried is this one and oh my god it smells amazing the thing is this range is quite pricey i'm not even gonna lie like i was like ah, 120 something for like a tub i was just ugh. anyway but the, the one thing that i really really love is this one this is the derma spa cashmere comfort hand rich treat okay this is the derma spa cashmere comfort rich hand treatment for restored um cashmere soft skin and this is for very dry skin so that's what it looks like right there so this was the first thing that i tried and oh my god like if you've tried anything oh lord if you've tried anything that smells like cashmere then you should have some sort of idea what what kind of scent they're going for it's a very clean but so nice it just smells it, it doesn't smell sweet but it smells so good and currently this is the one that i'm using on my bedside table this is sitting on my bedside table for every evening after i've brushed my teeth and done my face and things like that and then i get into bed and i um moisturize my hands and this has been working wonders for something for dry skin it is actually not that rich which i like as compared to the palmer's ones the palmer's ones are very very rich but this one dissolves very quickly into the skin and is very nourishing and moisturizing i absolutely love this Woo, i love it and then the next thing that i picked up is the cashmere comfort bigger size cocooning body lotion for restored cashmere soft skin that's what that one looks like as you can see this one i haven't tried yet but i'm pretty sure yep the scent is very very similar to the other one but definitely can't wait to try this i am still on something else at the moment so I just have to be i just have to relax but i think i will um have these for when i'm traveling or when i'm going to sleep over at a place somewhere i don't know but yeah i'll definitely try this one out and let you know from the same line derma spa as well i picked up the derma spa goodness three silky body oil for velvety soft even looking and luminous skin and that's what this one looks like there's a very shimmery sort of body oil you can see it's got golden flecks in there which actually looks really really nice something about this and looking at it like this reminds me of honeycomb it's a very honeycomb kind of color but it also just screams luxury so i really can't wait to try this one out i think this one was somewhere around the 90 rand mark they are quite pricey i'm not gonna lie and then the last thing i got is the derma spa cashmere comfort body butter and as you know, I'm a body butter lover. I buy body butters from the beauty factory. I buy body butters from the body shop. So I'm a huge body butter lover. I could not leave without picking this up. And this one is the most expensive out of the range, which I checked. Um, it's got cell moisturizers and yeah, it's also covered up as you can see, but this is a tub. How big is this tub? 300 milliliter tub. So definitely gonna try this one out as well. And that is pretty much it. I hope you guys enjoyed my Discam body care haul. I wanted to do a haul, but I wanted to do it on something very different and not makeup as usual. So yeah, I decided to go with body care. Yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Until the next one, I will see you very, very soon. Bye.